Hello everyone, my name is Sir Spooks and today we'll take a look at 5 ghost voices caught on EVP recordings. EVP stands for Electronic Voice Phenomena and are recorded sounds that may sound like spirits' voices. Thank you to this awesome viewer for suggesting the topic. As always, if you have any suggestions for future countdown videos, let me know in the comments down below. There will be a combination of video and audio in this list and some of them are pretty terrifying to listen to, so consider yourself warned. With that said, let's start off the list. The hugely popular paranormal investigators Ghost Hunters were investigating Mount Washington Hotel in New Hampshire when they caught the voice that was believed to be the ghost of an old lady. It is believed that the voice came from a woman in Victorian garb that many guests claim to have seen sitting on a bed in room 314. The room they caught the EVP inside. This is probably one of the craziest EVPs we've ever caught, just because of how interactive and how long it is. Wow. Here we go. You ready? Crazy. Yeah. Yeah. I picked that up. <laughs> but uh, yeah, this is the original bed. And, uh, this is tying in with some of the experiences. Princess, are you in here? Yeah. Princess, can you at least let us know you're in here? Wow. Well, you say something, move something. In the beginning, you can hear what sounds like, hello, is there somebody there? Right. Princess, are you in here? I could hear that crystal clear. At one point, Jay says, Princess, are you in the room? And it sounds like she says, of course I'm in the room. Where are you? Princess, can you at least let us know you're in here? Can you say something? Can you say something? It does indeed sound like a woman is trying to communicate with the investigators, but let me know what you think. This footage comes from a TV news crew that went out to interview Richard Smith from Paranormal Investigations of Texas, a supposed expert in the area of EVP recordings. In the audio, multiple different voices can be heard. Take a listen. Could a simple tape recorder be the medium between the living and the dead? It's the focus of a new film, and it's been debated for decades. Regardless of what you believe, tonight's up close is generating a lot of noise. White noise, or simply the ambient, at atmospheric noise. It's always out there. That's always there, yes. Accumulation of all noises. In a recording, it sounds like this. But if you listen closely, you might hear something else. Richard Smith does, with the help of his small voice recorder. And now I'm going. 1995 at Radio Shack. And a little white noise. He hears dead people. You hear her saying, help me. And he hears them everywhere. This is the word Chris is here. Some need a little help. In January 2007, the Central New York Ghost Hunters were invited to investigate an old hotel in upstate New York. The owners asked for them to keep the location confidential. What they called an EVP has been described as the most terrifying EVP ever recorded. I don't know if that's true, but it's definitely very violent and disturbing to listen to. To record the EVP, they chose the stairway because they had heard soft conversations and footsteps on the floor above, although no one was up there but instead they heard something far more terrifying. In the recording, three females talking can be heard, but sounds of a struggle or an attack can also be heard. Apparently you can also hear the voice of a man who was definitely not present at the time of recording, as the entire ghost on the team were female. Since the full recording is 10 minutes long, I can only show you a few bits here and there, but I suggest you check out the full thing if you're interested. 
Link is as always in the description. In another episode of the show, Ghost Hunters, the team went out to investigate near the site of where Charles Manson's cult brutally killed five people in 1969. In this episode, many paranormal events took place, but one of the creepiest was the EVP they recorded. Well, good, then you can listen to these and you can let us know if they sound the least bit familiar to you. Oh, yeah, please. All right, here we go. You ready? Are you angry about what happened? <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> uh, I'll just say that no, I have never heard that sound ever in my entire life. Yeah. yeah. E EVPs are not the most comfortable thing to listen yeah, to. Yeah, but that's just... You ready? Yeah. <laughs> Any idea? Any guesses as to what it's saying? It's, it's, it sounds like it's a... Uh... It's, uh, something or other, but I hear definitely it's, that's, wow, that is very, very, very interesting. Well, that's not the last of it. It's all right, Back in Michael's right Yeah, that one sounds like it's in complete despair. Personally, I, I have to strongly state I'm not much of a believer in EVPs, but after hearing that, I am just dead curious as to what the hell that is. Any guesses as to what it's saying? The first words I hear is, why did something, why do I have so much? That really just takes me to another level of going, okay. That was really creepy. It sounded like it was the voice of a scared little girl. A TV news crew went out to investigate any paranormal happenings in the Goldfield Hotel, and two times they captured ghostly voices on EVP. In the video, they seem very convinced that something paranormal is going on in the hotel. Take a look. Now tonight, some of the EVP that has the paranormal world buzzing at 11. One of the clearest responses ever, on tape. Not once, but twice. You will not believe your ears tonight at 11. After midnight, our party of seven again took to the halls. Again, there is no power to the building, so we had to use flashlights and lanterns. And could you please talk to us, please? Throughout the halls, we would stop and try EVP or electronic voice phenomenon. The dead talking, caught on tape. Have you been here for a long time? And if you guys did it, could you at least tell me in the recorder if you did it? Could you always tell me in the recorder? I was not thank you, but we've done. Did anybody say that? Nobody said that. No. 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 Thank you, but we've done it. Play it yeah. One more. Can you play it one more? Oh man, I got chills, chills, chills. Could you always tell me in the recorder if you did it? Oh. Oh wow. Oh, I got a class A more. Could you always tell me in the recorder if you did it? Could you always tell me in the recorder if you did it? 
So if you know of anybody that did it, can you let us know, or can you move just a little piece of plaster? It doesn't seem to hurt anything. It doesn't seem to hurt anything. It doesn't seem to hurt anything. And that was five terrifying ghost voices caught on EVP recordings. Let me know what you thought about these creepy audio recordings in the comments down below. And subscribe now so you don't miss what's next. My name is Sir Spooks and I'll see you all in the next video. Thank <laughs> you.